Hello guys. So kita hari ini dapat parcel baru daripada DHL. I've been waiting this parcel for quite some time around 4 days. So before that, we drink coffee first. And uh vape on. Okay, let's do this. I'm not going to tell you why is this, but it's, it's gonna surprise you. It's not, not a review or anything, just an unboxing. Bismillah. Can you guys see it? Ah, there you guys see it? <coughs> Can you guys see it? What is this? <laughs> it's a MacBook Air. I've been wanting to buy this because I have my desktop for heavy lifting. And I do have a MacBook Pro M4 for my office. But my office MacBook, uh, they are on VPN and um, they have some sort of policy whereby I cannot plug in any USB and a lot of stuff. So I decided to buy a new one for myself for personal use. So I can control my home lab and everything. Here you go. MacBook Air. It's a uh, 10 core, 10 GPU, and 24 gig RAM. Bought it for 7,200, I think. It's not bad at all. Let's open it. My first MacBook was a MacBook Pro 2012, bought it in the year 2012. Used for some time and then it loses its power. Then I used an Office MacBook M3 and then this is my second MacBook which I purchased. There you go, can you see it? It is the midnight black color. Nice, right? So this is the main unit, the MacBook. And I receive the cabling. And some sort of book and stickers, I think. I do show, receive a sticker. Let me see. I like the sticker, so it's quite important for me. No, they don't give the sticker. Hmm. But it's okay. I do have the sticker one from my office MacBook. I got it a new one, new in the box when office gave it to me. It's okay. And this is the UK plug. Let's unwrap it. And this is also the heat unit. Okay, that's all. That's everything inside the box. Let's try to boot it. And here's the box. Nice, right? I'm quite excited as well. I'm gonna keep the box just in case. Uh, maybe after three or four years, I'm gonna sell it. So I, if I'm selling it, at least there is a box. There's a value on it. Should I charge it or not? Let's try. Okay, let me flip the camera. Oh, 
okay here you go guys from the internet it says it's a finger and i believe so yes my wife got a same model but it's a m3 this one is a m4 it does a uh, magnet on your fingerprint so there you go it opens right away let's try to set it up <coughs> let me set up my camera here so you guys can see whatever i do and i adjust a bit my angle so guys bear with me i'm trying to give you guys the best angle the best video quality i'm not a professional i mean videographer or reviewer but i'm going i'm trying to be a, the best i can so here's when you open your laptop the new macbook it will give you this kind of uh, view hello in multiple language i press enter and then it will ask you okay what language you Use want english to do english is the main language oh. press the return key i select english okay so i choose where is my location my location is malaysia There you go. Continue. Do I'm 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 not going to sync this with my lap office laptop. So set up as new. There's this one is all standard. Not now. So I'm going to connect my Wi-Fi. So Wi-Fi is connected. We're going to do this very slow. Drink coffee and vape on. Data and privacy, I agree, continue. Okay, so I'm not going to show you my real name. So just a moment, okay? So it's setting up. Uh, terms and agreement so I read and agree <coughs> setting up my account here we go So basically what I'm going to install is to some video editing using DaVinci Studio 20 and the great thing is uh, it has a GPU so it will be decoded or processing using the GPU and I also need to connect to my home lab my server maybe using NordVPN MeshNet or Tailscale or WireGuard I don't know yet and it is very practical to be able to work in a cafe or anywhere i i i like the idea but not every day because uh sitting on a cafe is very expensive where you buy a coffee buy cakes or anything for food it will cost you easily 20 to 30 ringgit yeah you can't do that for every day maybe once or twice a week should be okay so i will do more of that <clears throat> but one thing when working in a cafe if you want to go to the toilet or the bathroom you have to leave your laptop right but i don't think that is safe so usually i put everything in the bag and go into the toilet together with the bag i also prefer more outdoorsy cafe so I can vape 
Paradise, okay. Sometimes the cafe is a uh, glass type. I can see uh, the my laptop from outside while vaping. I was quite skeptical when uh, I would like to buy this MacBook Air because I already spent my desktop for 15000 so I don't know whether I'm going to um, spend another, another 7000 but my wife approves it so I guess if wife says okay then it's okay let me put the password So location service is on, that guys analytics off, app analytics off, Siri is on, screen time is off, apparent is light, wallet, yeah it's already seen, so continue, do I want Apple detergent, yes, turn on file vault description, yes, okay, touch ID, so I'm going to use my ID. So we, we need to give all surface of our finger so it can detect. Oh, one more. Okay, done. I like the how Apple Mac OS or OS X it's very uh, seamless, very easy to use, and it's very, very smooth. <coughs> there you go. Welcome to Mac. So continue. Yeah, here we go. Ready to, ready for Apple Intelligence. They say that um, the MacBook Pro screen is better uh, compared to MacBook Air because MacBook Pro has a mini OLED but I think it's okay it's fine for me everything looks fine now okay let's see the spec there you go cheap Apple Man 4 memory 24 gig and Mac Sequoia There you go guys, my latest purchase. So hopeful, hopefully they're gonna benefit me in a lot of ways. Stay tuned, I'm going to make more reviews. Thank you guys. Pender out.